Hey, what's going on, people? Hey, this is Pastor Rod, lead pastor of the Place Church, and uh, I know it's kind of late, and you know, than my usual, you know, time of daily encouragement or advice or you know what have you. But I just don't want to just kind of be throwing these videos out there, and you know, and they really don't have any meaning behind them, or there's no, you know, there's nothing to them, you know. So I, I want it to be something. So if I don't do the video, then that means it's just you know maybe something I just didn't get that day, you know. But um, nonetheless, so listen. How many of you have ever had friends, people, associates, or whatever, that maybe you dealt with or you ran with in the past, you know, or, or you know, or vice versa, you know, people had, you know, people ran or dealt with you? Well, you know what? Sometimes everyone is going to come to a point in their life where it's time for them to elevate. It's time for them to go to another place. And this is the problem with that. Sometimes... People are not ready to go to other places. They are, they're comfortable and they're content right where they are. You know, on a mountain, there's a place that's called the snake line. It's a line by which a snake can't go past because they become suffocated. Well, this is the thing. Sometime to get past the mountain, you got to get off of the mountain. Eagles don't spend time hanging out on mountains. They spend time out away catching flight, you know, making sure that their wings are, 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 you know, being sustained by where they visit, you know, by the winds that are carrying them wherever they're trying to go. So think about it like this. There may be some people that you've tried to hold on to. And those persons may have been the thing that has been holding you down because it's nothing like holding on to a person that's drowning and you're trying to help them because what happens is. You can end up drowning right along with them. Now, on the other hand, now maybe you were that person and somebody may have stopped dealing with you or maybe stopped, you know, fooling with you or whatever. And maybe you were that person that was not ready to make a change or, you know, uh, uh, elevate in life or whatever the case may be. And I'm not saying that any of it is, is wrong. But what I am saying is, you know, don't make yourself feel, you know, don't get disheartened, you know, maybe because somebody is not talking to you like they used to or dealing with you like they used to. Maybe. They've, you know, needed to go on up to where they're trying to go because God does have the ability to begin to call you away from things that you're familiar with, things that you've been used to doing and, and, and people you've been used to talking to and all of that. You know, we've all had those kind of situations in our lives. We've either had the situation or we've been the situation. One of the two. And it's OK because it's a part of spiritual growth. Listen, guys, don't be don't, don't trip about it. Don't trip about it. It's going to happen, you know what I'm saying? And guess, but guess what? In, in the end, you'll be better for it. Just don't suffocate yourself or nobody else. That's all I'm saying. So, listen, as I close this up, I want you guys to do this. Do me a favor. Go out, reach out, connect with us. And um, so you can see how you can get connected to The Place Church by logging on to www.theplaceworship.org. www.theplaceworship.org. And listen, February 20th is coming up. And, um, you know, for those that can... We're starting our uh, our Bible study on February 20th. Uh, it's going to be at Cora Thomas Elementary, um, 6822 Irby Cobb uh, Boulevard in Richmond, Texas, 77469. So when you get a chance, I want you to go to the website, www.theplaceworship.org, to see how you can connect with us. And listen, prepare yourselves for February 20th. We'll be kicking off our Bible study on February 20th. It's a Thursday night. 7 p.m. and we're going to start out in, in this series called The Experiences. The Experiences. Notice I'm putting the emphasis on the word X, E, X. So, listen guys, this has been Pastor Rod. Thank you for joining me today and uh, look forward to hearing from you soon. Facebook, Twitter, social cam, YouTube, all of that good stuff. Alright? Living life one minute at a time. Peace.